Yeah, Rising Star. Sweary, I love you, man. You gave us something. You gave us more than we could have ever expected from considering what we have in front of us. All the characters in this are fictitious. Any resemblance to real persons or groups is purely coincidental. Just in case. Any of you who play the game know like, Oh, wow. Oh, look how great it looks. Look how flat that tree is! <laughs> They're not even trying to hide it! <laughs> I forgot that the Sparse Twins were in this game. Oh. I mean, come on, guys, look. Yep. Yep, that's Grace. Yeah. Oh, voice acting so good. Aren't you guys intrigued by this dialogue? <laughs> look at those ground textures. Look at those! He's clipping through the floor! You guys saw that. I s you have it's to It's dangerous have. to run around here, boys. You guys had to have seen that. Grandpa, hurry! Hurry Grandpa, up! Grandpa, you're too slow! Oh, I love this game so fucking much. It's great. <laughs> oh, so any of you who are wondering... There's this uh, TV series a while back called Twin Peaks. And this game creator, identified as Sweary, I think he's Sweary Skywalker at the moment on Twitter. Um, yeah, there he is. He was like, I want to make a Twin Peaks game. And then the guys who obviously own Twin Peaks were like, no, fuck off. So he was like, fine, I'm just going to rip it the fuck off. And then every time that people would interview him, be like, is this just Twin Peaks? He'd be like, no. Definitely no. Of course not. It's my own game. What are you talking about? Jay's Katoka. So yeah, I love this game so much. And as you guys will see over the course of this LP, you're gonna see why I love it so much. This game was made, by the way. You might think. Oh, I'm being a little bit harsh on this game. It was made in 2010. Like, this is not early Xbox 360. Oh god, look how oversaturated that is. I can barely see. She's using the world to stop time. Look at it! She's literally doing the pose and everything! Look at this JoJo opening. Jojo's Bizarre Adventure opening shit. <sighs> oh. <sighs> yeah, this, you remember that snake from fucking Metal Gear Solid 3? There he is. He made his way to America. I think it was Metal Gear Solid 3, eh? Or was it, um, it was either Metal Gear Solid 3 or Peace Walker, I can't remember which, but there was a snake that came out of the scar. Or something. Fuck, I haven't played that game in forever. I love Metal Gear, though, so hopefully we'll get to play those at some point, too. Darn it. Whoa, why is the- f Do you see the grass, like, freaking the fuck out? You see- <laughs> That was like, um... You know when your TV's off? And you used to have, like, the white fuzz? Yeah. It was literally like that shit. It's great, I love it. So I don't know if you guys... Oh, look at that. Look at the city. Look how great it looks. Oh, it's my favorite song in the entire game. Random client farting into the microphone. See, that was really good. No! No! 
you're gonna get used to this song, because it gets used a lot. But yeah, so if you're wondering, the whole game is gonna be basically us trying to find out what happened to Anna, like, why she died, who killed her, all of that stuff. We'll get to that, though. I'm getting ahead of myself. Enjoy how terrible this game looks. And you probably notice there's a slight green, like, filter on everything. Yeah, he put that on there on purpose. Like, I was gonna play it in the director's cut of the game. They removed the green filter, but for some reason the director's cut doesn't work. I can't get the director's cut on the Xbox One, unfortunately, so I'm just playing the OG version. Which is its entirely own kettle of fish in a way. That bartender's also a police officer. That's, that must be super awkward for all the kids trying to jump in there. Yeah, directed by Sweary, our lord and savior. All right, let's get started. As you saw, this game came out in 2010. Uh, let's play it on fucking normal, I guess. Players want to enjoy combat. Skillful use of weapons will be required to clear the game. Start with this difficulty set. Okay. It can hold 15 plus 1 bullets, so you- so... 16? I believe is the number you're looking for? <laughs> I think it means the magazine in the chamber, I don't know. Or the clip in the chain- uh, chamber. Sorry for any gun aficionados. Hey look, it's our main character. Mr. Francis York Morgan. These kids. Look at his face! He's like, what the fuck is going on? Oh man, I haven't played this game in so Oh, I forgot how terrible tank controls. A, B, with on the screen. Act with A, and save with B. Doll. Shaped like a fat man. That's a play on it. Which reads Washington State. Hmm. I'm gonna have to get used to... Can I make this go quicker? Oh, there we go. There we go! I had to find it. Strange clock's taken away. The room itself makes you feel as though time has stopped. It's almost as if... His stand. No, I'm joking. I'm sorry. Will they... Will I be consistently doing those jokes? Maybe. It depends on the situation. Oh, oh okay. Sorry to keep you waiting. Special bean cannon? It will start soon. What will start? It's about time to get started. What are you talking about? Random shit kids? Look at his face! Oh yeah, I forgot about this. It's time for us to... Is it time for the... Zack. Is it time for racial profiling? Zack, can you hear me? It's me, York. Yeah? If you can hear my voice, could you respond? Yes. Ah, good. I thought you went to sleep. Zack, don't be surprised. The crime took place out in the country this time. Let's take it slow. Yeah, let's just chill. Okay, sir. It's only a murder. Oh no, no racial profiling yet. Sure, that's one way of looking at it. But it's totally wrong. Yeah! It's our main boy, Mr. Francis York Morgan, FBI Special Agent. Listen, they both need each other. It's called interdependency. And they both know it. Like I said, yeah, we're going to be playing as this he guy figuring out the murder of Anna. Nasty, even sadistic things. But that's fine, as long as that's what Tom wants. Yeah, Think as long as it's what he wants. Actions. He's always asking for it. It's his partner's job to fulfill that need, and Jerry knows that. Yeah, exactly. Tom and Jerry. Proof? Well, in the Tom and Jerry show, they live with each other. You know? They're in Hello? a, like... 
fetishized relationship. Oh. Like, Tom's asking for those things. It's gratifying for him. That's the subtext, guys. The they gave still can't for each other. How did you phone? not know? These puppies are making me go to another town in the boondocks again. Well, another town in the boondocks again, eh? If it ends up being a waste of time. I think that's improper English, there, buddy. Yeah. Right, Zach. The perpetrator from the last case really was something. Would have thought there'd be razors laced into your nails. What? Crazy. Just crazy. Yeah, laced into the nails. That's that's no, at least I now have a scar to show off. Yeah. Cool guy scar. See what? This? I got this when I arrested the cat woman wannabe. Did you see that those yeah, cigarettes are like police Don't branded that? cigarettes? That's great. That car's not moving. Don't smoke, guys. See that lighter that says don't smoke? Obviously. Did you guys- Oh no, I'm joking. I was gonna say, do you guys see the mouse carry the car over the railing? But that wasn't real. You ready for this scene? This is gonna set up the rest of the game. If that doesn't set up the rest of the game, I don't know what will. <laughs> Why is the car sparking? Cars on. <laughs> That's like a really old car. Like, maybe it is run on electricity, but I doubt it. York looked really small compared to the car for a second then. I don't know if you guys noticed that. Well, at least he's okay. Completely unscratched. Oh, now the light is working in the rain. Obviously. Fuck, why didn't I think of that? But I'm guessing that it's too wet now. Hmm. Was that really necessary, though, to the scene? Do you hear that random owl who just won't shut the fuck there up? There goes the civilized world. Yeah, there goes the civilized world. Time for us, uh, the civilized world of random coat killers trying to shove us off into the forest and die. The civilized world where chipmunks make don't make fucking chimpanzee noises. Wow. Look at that fire, guys. Look how great that looks. What we got here? Steel pipe. I got it. It's mine now. How do I equip shit? I forget. We'll get to that. Is there an item there? No? Okay. I keep forgetting that this is tank controls. Jesus Christ. Oh. What was it? Uh, take item out? I got nothing. Wow. That is. A, wasn't that a really great noise, guys? Uh, fucking hell. Look at these menus! It's been so fucking long. Quit. Please. How do I... Okay. Oh shit. That is... That looks so good. Look at it. Amazing. Great. Fantastic. Nice. Just get used to the combat a little bit there. Let's go. Which way though? That's the question. What happens if I press back? Is that the map? Yeah, it is. Oh, that noise is awful. I love it. Ooh, agent honor. Thank you. We got 30 bucks because we found a random agent on a... nothing? Oh no, there's something. What is it? First aid kit. Take it. Small. Anything else? No? One car. Then away we shall go. Into the boondocks. Away from the civilized world. 
variation on a... Jesus Christ. These are tough wood... Man, this is some tough wood, man. Five bucks. Just found five bucks. Which way now? Oh. Uh, look at him fighting to himself there, he's sniffing it, he loves it. A sub racial profiling. You see all these? These are all spoilers for the entire game. It's good that you can barely see them, right? And out of context, you haven't got a Looks clue like what any of that to... means. Zach, I'll let you handle the meet and greet. Yes, voice inside my head. I hear voices in my head, they talk to me, they understand. I'm sorry. Wait, is that the way it came? What the fuck? Right, which way are we going first? Um, so I can... Let's head down the way that doesn't lead anywhere first, eh? Oh, look. Look at this. Can't see much. Through this fog. Path might be blocked from the rain. You should stay away from obvious danger. You know, no, I'm just gonna walk away. It's not interesting. That's not interesting. It's just danger. Fuck danger, man. Alright, let's go this way then, shall we? Can I destroy this? Or am I, like, do I not know anything? Nope. Apparently it doesn't even react. I don't know what I expected. My expectations were higher than nothing, I guess. I hear Doggo. Is he gonna... Ew. You guys hear that? Guys, what? What the fuck? What? But where? What was there? Nothing was there! Huh? The noises kept happening, despite the fact that I was right there. Like, where did he go? Did he just teleport away? Oh, there we go. Oh, nothing. Did you see his face? He was like, mm. Oh, my heart rate was racing for a second there. Oh. Look at this, like, Resident Evil, like... Oh, Jesus. Oh, I got... Oh, okay, there's a weapon wheel. Fucking hell. Oh, my God. So if I turn the analog stick, it spins on a cycle, and if I press forward, it goes forward, and it's literal tank controls. But only for that, s only there. Like now it's normal-ish, but I think it's because of the camera, obviously being up there. But like if I turn left and right, then it just turns on an axis here as well. But it's a lot less, it's a lot more disorientating when the camera doesn't follow you. That's fine. RE4 is one of my favorite games, and that has tank controls. Ooh. What have we got? Hello? Ma'am? Hello? Oh, nothing, okay. Oh, yeah, it's a can of pickles. Wow, that looks terrible. What was that made on Microsoft Paint or some shit? Doesn't look like anyone lives here. No reclusive hairy brutes to greet us. Is that a reference to RE4? In the first dude, we meet some like hairy dude who like speaks angrily to us in Spanish. That was easy. Now that random gate in the middle of the forest is open, thank fuck. Who the fuck puts a gate out here, man? What row? She's been finger painting, guys. She's gonna do the Japanese thing. Oh no! The Japanese thing where they decide they want to walk at you facing the wrong way. Oh no. Why can't I shoot? Can I shoot please? I got mysterious shadow. That's one of the clues. Can I shoot now please? Has 
off. Amazing. Oh no, the music is so scurry. Whatever will I do, guys? Yeah, it's me. Oh no, it's Great. Karen. Great shot. Great shot. You guys hear that? I love that about this game too. Whenever you get headshots. Yo, you saw me. Whenever you get a headshot in this game, you will cast a comment. Great, amazing, fantastic, full side. I fucking love that shit. Give me that first aid kit. But it's funny as well, you'll see later when I get uh, some weapons with a higher fire rate. That he just can't help himself with how much he has to say how great he is of a shot. It's nice though that York is telling me that I did a good job. He likes to remind me that I'm good at video games, guys. Sometimes you need your protagonist to just tell you how great you are. He needs to build up your confidence. Let's look at the racial profiling. Half of this stuff we haven't even seen yet. But yeah, okay. How many of those things did you see, guys? I've been I didn't through see a lot of crazy situations, but that one. That one takes the cake. It's the first time I've been attacked so directly. Zack? Can you give me a logical explanation about what that was? No. Never mind, don't answer. Life is fun because of the mysteries. Right, Zack? Yeah, right, Zack? Now you guys might be wondering... Who is Zack? Is he a voice in his head? Is he... Something else? I, I'm not gonna tell you. Just... Play the- just watch the game! Guys? Oh, that was a phone call. Hello? So this is how you save your game. Overwrite the save data, bitch boy. It's pretty quick. Thank you, Garm. Thank you for- I got an extra bit of money for calling in. Imagine if you like went at your job and you phoned in, you were just like, yeah, I'm still alive. And they were like, I'll oh, call cool, his ten dollars. Good job. Thanks for telling us you're still alive. Here's ten bucks. Ooh, this one's exploded. Agent Honor, boys. That's what this game is all about. So I just need to reload. Hello? I don't see no one. Nothing? Fucking nothing. Just in case you were wondering, guys. Oh no, it's okay. Whoa! He's doing six fades. Amazing. Nice, drop me a nice pipe. Respect it. Respect the pipe. Okay, let's get this on, shall we? Open up the second gate in the middle of nowhere. Shall we? Can I push these? Yeah, I can push these. Watch this now. The game gets very confused on what's supposed to happen when you push something in the corner. And then it just starts to break. It takes a while. But then again, so does shooting it. So I don't really know what you want me to tell you. There we go. See? Perfect. That's my little easter egg for you guys. I'm pretty sure if I push them into each other it does it too. Oh, oh. That was good. GG. GG guys, no worry. Oh man. Here it's me. Shot. He 
so hyped, guys, at how much of a good shot I am. Oh, Jesus. Let's push this out of the way. Wait, does it break when I'm pushing it? Like, regardless? I thought it was only if I pushed it... Oh my god, I thought it was only when you pushed it, like, some of the way. I've never seen that before in all the times that I've played this. But then again, I guess I just shot my way through it last time or piped my way through it. Ah! Give myself some space. You coming? You doing your moonwalk over here? What? 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 Oh, okay. I was confused then. I thought that the character model just decided that it was done. He was just like, no, nah, I'm just gonna chill by here. Uh... Game. <laughs> that was strange. I don't know if that's because the body was on the floor or if the game just decided it wasn't ready. You guys proud of me? That was good, right? I did a good job. Right? That's just a- oh no. Hmm. Did you see the veins on his face? Jesus! This guy is stressed! Generally looks really bad, Zach. I think the killer's really- I think the killer really has a grudge against it. The killer. Machine broken by an axe. I got it. I picked it up. The whole thing. Let's do some more racial profiling. Now I'm only going to do it this way the first time. Just so you can see what it's like. For the rest of them, I probably won't let them happen. Just because they take forever. And they don't actually add anything. Huh? Zach, let's try to find a way to fix this mess. Got the fuse box. Generate looks really bad. It's like I think the killer really has a grudge against it. I think... Wait, I think the killer has a grudge against it? Like, is that like... That's posed as a genuine question. He's like, ah yes. The killer. His demographic seems to be generators, apparently, eh? Which way am I going? I think I'm going this way. Yeah, I came from that way, because there's a save point. Oh, by the way, in case you're saying, why don't you zoom out of the map, idiot? That's the maximum you can zoom out, as you can probably see in the bottom right-hand corner. Because why would you need to zoom out more than this? Like, look, you can fucking... Oh, whatever. There's no time. Well, we can't... Oh, why is freaking the fuck out? I like it. Hey, buddy. No pipe there? Pipe? Uh, barrel? Bullseye. Bullseye. Yes. Look at the character model going nuts. Because we're too far away and he doesn't know what to do. So the frames just drop. It's like, nah, he's too far away. He's not going to be looking this way. Oh, the door's locked. Whatever will I do? However will I deal with this situation? I truly... Oh. Murdering random goobers. Okay. Now let's shove the entire fuse box in here. Surely you should have like taken the fuses instead of the entire section of the model from the generator. Now nah, he just like went into OBS or Photoshop and he just cropped it out and took it, saved it into his clipboard so that he could paste it back here. Apparently the should be much more stable now. Yeah. Sorry, Zach. He cropped that shit out, he chucked in his uh, clipboard, he saved it. And he's like, cool. Oh, and then he was like, oh, here we go. And then he pasted it into the spot. Yeah. Oh, bro. Jesus, explosion, that's a white, like... 
Hey, buddy, look at him. Great. Amazing. I did kill you. Well, did he say kill me? Did he say kill me or you killed me? Because either way, the answer is yes. Ah! Who came up with the dialogue for these guys, man? Yes. I need to know what his thought process was when he came up with such lines as I'm dying yes. and I see you and I kill people. I'm good at the combat, guys. Shut up. What are you talking about? I got a headshot with me. See? That's how good at the combat I am. Oh no! No, they were coming to get me. It's like the village in Ari. I'm sorry. How many times I even mentioned Ari before this? in the first episode? Can I? Oh, he's too far away. Oh no, he's doing phases. He's shadow dashing. Oh shit! Back it up. Back it up, boss. Do that agent on her. Wait, bitch, wait. Ooh, more agent on her. No, somebody else crashed here too. Apparently, this is just a line of car crashes. Great, amazing. Yeah, you see him just get. Do you see the mouse drag him through the floor there? He unclipped and dragged through the floor. He typed in slash clip. Oh shit. Piss off. Amazing. Yes. You don't want to die. Should have thought about that. Oh yeah, you've seen that, guys. Which way do I need to go? That's the question. Yeah, this is the right way. You know what? Can I just run through this? Yeah, fuck you guys. Bad had enough. Wasted enough time on all of your bullshit. We're gonna do the survival horror thing and run away. Like big mans. Bye! Oh shit! Yeah, you see me wave dash through? Look at him now, he's like, no, 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 bye. He just left. He tried to grab me one time and then he was like, nah, fuck it. I haven't cornered and everything, but fuck it. Just let him go. It's more fun that way. Listen to that squeaky wooden door, guys. That that clearly is. <laughs> Do you see him? He was like, ooh. I got some red ivy. I mean, I didn't. I watched it. I watched red ivy is the actual phrase that you want, Spirit. You see, I think the last one, it does it automatically. So if I just leave... Oh, Jesus. Why is the game loading? Where'd you pick that up from? Why aren't you holding it properly? There's definitely something in this town. Do you feel it, Zach? Yeah, I mean, there's this... Coffee warned me about it. Yesterday morning, the milk I poured in my coffee made a sign. It said, Tomorrow you'll arrive in a place that will change your fate. Yeah. You guys have that too, right? In the morning. When you pour your coffee, sometimes... A little, like, coffee face. Like, the milk, like, curdles. Not curdles, because, like... It's not gone off yet, but it like clouds it into words or like a face that just speaks to you The milk just Ooh, And then a face comes out just like oh tomorrow's gonna be pretty good actually. Fuck was that? Let's run I guess 
Let's go, guys. All the way over this way. Greenvale National Preserve. Do you see how important this part is to the game, guys? You see the fucking rope clipping on the sides? Jesus Christ, man. Look how important this is. There's, there's nothing happening! In the 6 a.m. The fuck? What is going on? Oh, Jesus. Now you were very late. Wow, you hear that music, guys? She's just, wow, she's so pretty, she's so beautiful. I didn't think you'd keep me waiting in the rain for so long. FBI Special Agent, Francis York Morgan. Yeah. Please, just call me York. Call me York. Everyone That's what does. everyone calls me. Agent York? Good, that's good. Yes, that's right, yes. yes Are Agent you the York. sheriff? Uh, no, I'm Deputy Sheriff Emily Wyatt. George, he's the sheriff. He went looking for you, actually. He should be back soon. Look at that water. I see. It's beautiful. If you don't mind me asking, did you walk all the way here? No. My car broke down, that's all. Yeah, don't tell them that you got a car crash. Oh, look how beautiful that water is, guys. And the grass textures. You see that Morrowind level of graphics? She's easy on the eyes. Definitely worth a trip to the primitive world. By she the way, just, don't mention anything about she's what She's just looking back there. directly at him, just She'll like, why? She's looking at him just like, what the fuck? Don't want that, do we, Zach? The yeah, don't Welcome want him to think you're a psycho, despite the fact you're holding your temple I'm and talking sheriff, to yourself. George Woodman. Call me George. Yeah. It's our boy George. The main man's himself. FBI Special Agent Francis York Morgan. Please, just call, call me York. That's what, what everyone calls, calls me. me. He's got a face scar too. Cause he's a cool boy, just like me. Could you tell me why the FBI is so interested in a small town homicide? Let's just say it's a personal interest in killers of young women. I'm always looking for new sample cases to help me with my profile. Both our superiors have cleared this with each other. You can remain in command. You don't have a problem with this, do you? Yeah, no. you're just in the lead. No problem. Just want to set things straight. Our small town has its share of problems. I'm the one fixing them one by one and maintaining peace and order. You can have your profiling sample, but I need you to understand that. Of course. <clears throat> of course. By the way, George, I... I don't know how he knew that smoke on there car. so quickly, but whatever. Could you send someone to take care of it? Oh, and my clothes and luggage are still inside. All right, don't worry. I'll get my assistant Thomas to take care of it. Hmm. You know, he sticks his nose Do up you all need the time. Anything else? Thanks. That'll be all. How the fuck did you just well, blow that smoke I think out? I'll rest up first at the hotel. Then I'll join you on your investigation. Don't know how to say that. We uh, really what? don't need your help. Wow. Unlike some of your corrupt city police officers. I play it by the book. I hope you'll come to appreciate that, Agent Morgan. And we'll handle the investigation. You see the face? You just think of this as a vacation. Take it easy. Enjoy the nature here. You don't have to be a tree worshiper to appreciate the wildlife here. <laughs> you just blow a kiss? You see that shit? Let's reassess the situation. There are no cavemen here. We're as far forward as the Middle Ages. And we've just met the king. Yeah, he's blowing a kiss. I think we're gonna get in get a I love mom. Is that, is that what the fuck the car said? Babe blew me a kiss. I think he likes me, guys. What the fuck is happening? Yeah. I 
did a good job. Okay. I got 200 bucks. The basic unpaid salary. Wait, what? Those those two numbers don't add up. 200 plus 705 equals 1,055. Yeah, okay. I mean, if I'm getting more money, why am I complaining? If my job was like, we're going to give you 300 bucks and also 300 bucks, so here's 1,000 bucks, I'd be like... Yeah, okay. Oh, dude, that shotgun looked terrible. Zach view. Oh, we don't need to watch what happened in the previous investigation. We already- we, we just did it. Oh shit! My- My stamina bar was still up from the previous cutscene! What?! The previous- Oh, Jesus. Oh, fuck. Anyway... I guess we're gonna take this donut. Look at it, looks great. Looks delicious. Is there a phone somewhere so I can save the game, please? Angel Isaac. Yeah, that's good. Extra bonus for card. What the fuck even is the point of this room? There's nothing here! Ah, oh, fuck it. There's, there's the blackness. The darkness is behind that door. But there's also the darkness on this side. What's... Oh, that one's locked, eh? Okay. What's it say? It's locked. Wow, that was helpful! Great, okay. What about this one? I guess we'll go inside. 